That's not fair. All I want is a scooter. Is that too much to ask? Everyone in the whole world has got a scooter, except me. <sighs> Think of all the things I could do if I had a scooter. interrupt this edition of Too Cool for School with a very important news story. Yes, it's very important. Even more important than Too Cool for School. We have just learned that someone has stolen something really rare and very valuable from the museum. This sounds like a job for the Scoot Tutors! Don't you want any biscuits, boys? Mm, thanks, Mum. Those boys. Mrs. Crunch, can you tell us any more about the really rare and very valuable thing that has been stolen from the museum? Yes. Yes, I can. Um, could you tell us that? Yes. Yes, I could. Um, now would be good, Mrs. Crunch. Oh, uh, 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 yes. Uh, uh, who would have thought that one of our really rare and very valuable exhibits would be stolen from under our very noses? And that valuable exhibit would be, Mrs. Crunch? A worm! A worm? Yes, a worm. But not just any worm. One of the most rare and valuable worms the world has ever seen. No! Scoop two! Excuse Can me! Can we get through? Thank you! It's so easy being me. I'm in the park after tea. Oh, and Ralph, I've got wheels. <laughs> See you later. Stuck-up Steve still plays with number gnomes. I've got wheels. <laughs> Would you like some baked beans, number one number gnome? <laughs> number one nappy number gnome, you mean? Don't be horrid, Henry. See you later, Snooter Gators. Where are you going, Henry? To try out my new, I mean my new old scooter in the park. OK, but stay out of trouble. Otherwise, it'll be your old new old scooter. Does that even make any sense? Yes, Henry, it makes sense. Don't worry, number one, number gnome. The noisy, smelly monster has gone now. Cool, Henry. Is that your new scooter? Well, it's my new old scooter. Mm, one of Stock Up Steve's cast-offs. Looking pretty good, though. Come on, let's ride! <laughs> you all right, Henry? Yeah, I'm just getting used to it, I guess. Whoa! Look out, Brian! Oh, oh, oh. Phew! Thanks, Brian. Good book, Brian. Oh, 
Oh, yes. It's called The Scooter of Doom. And it's all about a scooter. No kidding. Oh, yes. It's all about a scooter that's haunted. A haunted scooter? Yes. The owner can't get rid of it and ends up having to ride it for the rest of his life. That sounds like one scary scooter. It is. Well, if you'll excuse me. Oh, yeah. Bye, Brian. <laughs> Better get off his flower bed, Henry. I'm trying, honest. But it won't go the way I want it to. <laughs> Henry, come on. Stop messing about. I'm not messing about, Ralph. This thing's got a life of its own. Phew, I'm lost. Someone has tampered with your music, Peter. neighborhood for the kids to grow up in and oh um hercules bad dog i must apologize has he eaten them all <laughs> don't worry it's just a few nuts i didn't know they could jump that high neither did i hmm he must enjoy a challenge hmm. got to be careful time for operation grizzly grub they're gonna love this henry you're supposed to be upstairs. But I want to meet Mr and Mrs Bossy. Crisp? How sweet. Mossy, not bossy. But Mum, isn't that what you always call them? <coughs> Peter, get Mrs Mossy a drink. Right away, Mum. Oh dear, come on Mrs Mossy, let's get you cleaned up. And you boys, go to bed. Certainly. Good night Mr Mossy, I hope Mrs Mossy gets better soon. <laughs> hmm, Grizzly Grub, eh? Haven't seen one of these in a long time. I dare you. Accident. And anyway, you're supposed to be in bed. Oh, what a shame. 
We've had a performance by Peter. How about Henry? Surely you can do something too, Henry. Oh, yeah. I can do karate. Hiya! Whoa! No! <laughs> Very good, Henry. But I have my own special martial art, Mossy Kido. Bedtime, Henry. It's so easy being me. I'm Look, there's a mountain lion right there! Uh, oh. Oh. What? No way! No way! No way. Oh, I see! This is not a mountain lion's natural habitat. Oh, it could have escaped from a zoo. Hmm, good point. There's no mountain lion! Are you having a laugh, Henry? No, look, it's on this side! <laughs> You were too slow! It's gone! Oh. What a great day! Soggy Sid had to cancel the lesson because nobody had their swimming costumes. Ralph, you're really pathetic. Oh, yeah? Well, this will really scare you. The school rang my mum. We've got an extra swimming lesson tomorrow. Tomorrow? And we're doing our badges. Five point three. Five point five. Ten past eight, Henry. Time for school. Swimming today. <sighs> Keep this to yourself, Andrew. A shark just escaped from the aquarium. Uh, a shark? Yes, a super intelligent mutant shark, and it's headed this way. So stay alert. Oh. Henry says there might be a sh sh shark in our pool. Sharks are saltwater creatures. They don't like chlorine. I don't like chlorine, but I still swim in it. Hmm, good point. <laughs> That's not even as good as the werewolf. I'm just warming up. <laughs> I'm going for my 1,000 metres today. <laughs> right, you lot. Get in the pool. Henry... Don't tell me. Sorry, sir. I can't swim today because... Enough excuses, Henry, you horrible child. I don't care if you've got a slight touch of leprosy or bubonic plague. You're swimming today. Get changed now. I'd love to, sir, but uh, unfortunately I forgot my trunks. Spare costumes. Put one on. I can't wear any of these. I won't! Get changed. It's so easy being me. I'm Horrid Henry. We will fight them in the treetops. We will fight them in the mountains. And we will fight them in the fairy rings of old. And we will never, never... Never give up! Bravo! Bravo! Well done, Andrew! Oh! I got the part! Yay! <laughs> Go team, Andrew! <laughs> I got the part too! <laughs> I got the fairy princess! You lucky escape. Um, what did you say, Henry? Uh, I said lucky you. Oh, <gasps> thank you, Henry. And remember, children, to make your voices loud and clear. Now remember, if you forget any of your lines, I'll whisper them to you. Good luck. <laughs> What a 
cold, dark day this is for the kingdom of the fairies. But we must face these times together. He's crying. We dance around the fairy ring, the fairy ring, the fairy ring. We dance around the fairy ring. La 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 la. Come on, that's not me up there. The tides of fate have turned against us. Oh, where shall we fly to, sire? Up to the carrot tops. <gasps> the tree tops. I mean, the raindrops. <gasps> tree tops. Mop tops. I think you mean tree tops. Oh, I, I, I can't do this anymore. <gasps> Henry, Henry, come here. You know the lines. You have to take over. What? The show must go on. What? Now go! <laughs> <coughs> we must fly to the treetops! <laughs> Anywhere. No, I was asleep, Fungus Head. All I've seen was the inside of my eyelids. I was asleep! But. Out! Aha! Uh -huh. I bet they're in here. Nope, not in here. And don't worry, I haven't forgotten about you, my little friend. It must be nearly feeding time. He watches, but you've just been fed. It's so easy being me. I'm horrid, Henry. Don't be horrid, Henry. Go 
Get your rum right now. Fine, I will. You want that one, Fluffy? Oh, I think that one's perfect for you, Fluffy Wuffy. It's pink and all fluffy and so cuddly, just like you are. Oh, it's just not fair, Fang. How can buying a bell for Fluffy Wuffy be more important than playing Gross Class Zero Zombie Train? Oh, it's not good. I can't get to sleep. Oops, that's my tummy. I'm really hungry. Think I need a snack to help me get to sleep. Want to come along for the ride? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa! Phew, that was close. the treats at the back, Fang. Let's try in here. <laughs> hey, these look good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tickly treats, the best to eat. <laughs> Let's see just how good they are, shall we, Fang? on the counter this morning. We didn't eat them all last night, did we? <coughs> Henry! I don't care if you only opened the packet. Someone has eaten all my tickly treats and all the evidence points to it being you, Henry. Your tickly treats? Yes, Henry, my tickly treats. The only treats I ever buy for myself, which is why they are hidden at the back of the cupboard. Ah. Uh. And if I find you taking my tickly treats ever again... All right, all right, I know. You don't have to tell me. Go and get dressed, Henry. Right now. It's so easy. 